What if I told you there's a better hook design than barbed or barbless that outperforms in fishing elements, that outperforms in fish safety elements? Have a look at grips. So why did I design a new hook? The truth of the matter is I'm in a position from a fishery management element and also my angling element to think about why are we only looking at two designs, the barbed and barbless? Why can't we have a third design? Let's find a way. Let's find a, a hook design that can create solutions to issues I think we do have in the existing two designs of barbed and barbless. So the whole principle for it was to find a hook design which was better, which performed better, which wasn't profit before performance, it was basically of the best materials I could find, but was fundamentally a different design. So the grips grooves are the main element of what the grips design is about. It's not another pattern or a series of other patterns, there's patterns within the design. So we've got the curved shank, your straight point, um, your wide gape, your trod hooks, and more patterns to come. But the fact is I wanted a hook that overrode uh, issues and uh, created solutions for problems I saw with barbed and barbless. To the, to the extent we're Palatrax as innovators, um, we're, we're looking at basically something that is at that next level, next generation, taking into consideration angling needs and angling wants, but also being a, having a very holistic approach to the environment we fish within. As a fishery owner myself, there is issues to me and this is my opinion obviously, um, with barbed. Um, fact is trailing fish, there's a load of reasons that you don't want to fish obviously trailing line, the hook can't be shed. And then with barbless I found an issue with the skipping, so when you're playing a fish a bit of disconnect with the line, so you're losing that tension, the hook can come up and then start ripping the inside of the mouth. So those kind of things were very aware of me. But could I find something that also performed better, that stayed sharper, that used the highest quality wire? So the idea was to then take the grips grooves, which basically the flesh of the, in the inside of the mouth that sits into those grooves. And so when you're playing, that fish, they stay solid. And when you release, they pop out like a barbless. And then also by basically using what we call cutting point design. Cutting point technology is the most expensive way to design a, the actual physical point element of the hook. And so you get, what do you get with a cutting point? You get the sharpest point by manufacturing. So it comes out, the, the packet's so, so sharp, so incredibly sharp, needle surgically sharp. So actually obviously a huge advantage in carp fishing, but also it stays sharp. So with the quality of the wire, it doesn't bend out or anything like that. But the actual point, you can catch fish after fish without having to, you know, lose the hook that you're on. You can keep on using it. So there's a plethora of different reasons we've designed the design to be fundamentally more effective in our angling, to be very holistic within our approach to fishing from the environmental aspect. So you're playing a fish. If you, do, you are unfortunate that you've actually you know, snapped off, that fish can easily get rid of that foot, um, hook design. Even down to like the level where if a, a bird or a child or any of us get a hook into us, they're easily to remove compared to a barbed. You don't get the skipping, you don't get the lack of confidence we can have by fishing barbless. So the proof is in the pudding. We've been using this design and really field testing it behind the scenes now for about five years. We've got thousands of anglers all over the world. Literally only last week I sent some to an island in the, in the South Pacific. So it's really getting out there. I don't ever want to come across as arrogant. I don't ever want to come as, off as contrived. But Palatrax is all about finding solutions to move us to another level, level in our own angling. Whether it's angling performance or whether it's about the fish safety element of it, Everything Palatrax produces is very much about a fishery management tool. We now have fisheries who historically have been barbless now moving across the grips. Here I am at the, on, the, on the Burfield estate, Advanced Angling's glorious Gold Lake Blue Pool and the main Burfield Lake. The owners and, and, the, and the, the management are so happy that we're using grips here, it's even in their rules. It's, it's a preferred option because you, you're having more angler success but also you're having less damage to any the fish at all, you know. So it's designed to be a win-win. It really, really does make a difference to your catch rate. Having something that stays so sharp, having something that stays in, no movement, 
and obviously when you release that pressure in the net or on the mat it's so easy to come out so it really is designed to be a win-win and, and, and on that note it's won international awards for its fish safety it's won international re recognition we we're all over the world with grips now whether it's thailand or whether it's canada or whether it's spain anglers embrace it once they understand the concept that it is genuinely a third design once they see and use it for themselves, it becomes a very much commonplace. And we've got thousands of people now converting to grips because it's a design that works. We've got people going to tackle shops asking for it because of that thirst for innovative gear that actually helps us catch more fish whilst being very mindful of the environment we're fishing in. So as I say, it is generally a win-win and I promise you, if you look at them, if you use them and you start seeing how they'll improve your catch rate, um, and all the other associated benefits, it's very, very difficult to go back to patterns and in, within designs that really we've moved on to the next level. As I say, we should never ever sit still in innovation. This industry doesn't tend to move on in a lot of areas. We've moved on and forward in lots of areas and the hook design, a third hook design is a fundamental for all of us. And if we can have a design that improves on the historic designs, that can only be a fantastic thing. So where do you buy this unique and innovative design of hooks? Where can you go and get grips? Pop into your local tackle shop. We're finding more and more good tackle shops are now stocking what is truly an innovative design.